Hello dear friends, it's me Vinod and today we will cover the topic of income tax law 1961. Profit and gains of business and profession. As per income tax law, we calculate uh, our net profit from business and profession which will be taxable as per laws. For this, uh, we have to make a profit and loss account. Profit and loss account. As per income tax law, not as per accounting rules. In the credit side, these are our incomes. And in the debit side, these are our expenses. Total business incomes will be credit. Now, debit side of expenses is important. What should we write here? Number first. Depreciation. Depreciation is an uh, important uh, expenses of business uh, which is not paid in cash but uh, it is allowed as per income tax law. So, number one, rates which are allowed by uh, income tax law. For example, For furniture, we will charge 10%. If uh, it is 20%, we will add 10% in the incomes. Just we add uh, in the debit side 10%. For example, computer, we will charge 60%. For building, if there, there is a commercial building, we will charge 10%, otherwise we will charge 5%. Like this, all the assets which are under income tax law, we have to charge depreciation. And second is rent. Only to only which building we use for uh, commercial commercial use we will show rent. Suppose uh, there are two parts of building. One building uh, we are using for personal use and uh, second part we are using for business use. Just uh, the half part and its uh, rent will be showing uh, in the profit and loss account. Uh, as per income tax law. Third, repair. Only business property repair and other current repair will be allowed as expenses. And uh, salary. If you have lots of employees, you are allowed as expenses, what do you pay as a salary? Legal expenses. You can show the legal expenses which you have paid for protecting your business or profession. In this, uh, you can add uh, advocates, uh, advocates, salary, or other fees, legal fees, and uh, other expenses. 
we will show all other expenses which are accepted as per income tax law section 28 now difference of this income minus expenses will be our net profit this is our one business this is our one business suppose we have 10 business then we will add net profit of first business net profit of second business net profit of third business suppose in one business we have loss then we will deduct loss net loss and exact total net profit from different businesses will be our profit and gain from our business or profession okay in next lecture i will more explain the depreciation rates as per income tax law thank you very much